What's up guys, Bearded here, and welcome to Soma. Um, I did start uh, recording this before Halloween, but I don't know why, but I had issues with it, and uh, one of the issues was uh, before I was recording my audio and all that separately. Sorry, that was my phone. And, uh... Uh, what was it? Like, the audio, I edited it and then saved it, but somehow... I, oh, I think my computer crashed or something, and then it deleted the file or... I don't know how that happened, but anyways. Because my computer rarely crashes, but anyways. And then, uh... Uh, the... The video worked at first, and then somehow it just became corrupt and then I lost all that and yeah so basically I'm starting from scratch I didn't play a whole lot into the game I mainly did the beginning that's why it says continue here but yeah so let's go ahead into new game yes and yeah I know this is going up after Halloween but I want to complete it because I bought the game right so why, why would I buy it and then just not play it I mean I could play it for my um, personal uh, reasons I guess I don't know but uh, I kind of want to make videos on it so uh, yeah it's going up after Halloween but whatever reality is that which when you stop believing in it doesn't go away <coughs> are you okay Simon I think you're bleeding oh that, that's nothing it's just my brain can't stop bleeding from the accident here take this no that that's for later for the scan it's green Looks red. Ashley, I need to tell you something. Simon, please don't make this weird. No, no, it's not like that. Does that mean her clothes that she's wearing is green too? Why now? Who's David Munchie? Why is there never enough time? For what? Does that also mean that the green on his dashboard is red? <laughs> I don't know why they made the liquid red when she said it was green. And hopefully my voice, uh... Ah, ah. <laughs> Christ. Hopefully my voice, uh, stays okay. I, uh, been having a little bit of issues yeah, with I'm it up. cold. Hi, Simon Jarrett? Yeah, that's me. My name is David Munchie. We spoke earlier. The brain scan. I remember. Are you alright? Yeah, yeah, just a bad dream. Are, are we still on for today? Yeah, that's why I'm calling. I wanted to remind you to drink the tracer fluid I sent you. It'll help me capture a better image of the damages. Don't worry, I, I I got it somewhere. Okay, great. Well, I'll see you in a couple of hours then. Okay, see you soon. All right. To move around, use the, okay. Yeah, I'm already doing that. Um, I think it was over here. Oh right, there's some stuff I have to do here. Thank you for participating in our research. The scan will be performed at the Pace Laboratories in Toronto, but since we are guests, uh, our access is a bit unpredictable. I will try to schedule a scan session for Saturday. I'll get back to you when confirmed. I'm happy to hear your headaches have become less frequent. Your latest tests show your brain is slowly recovering, but it's still too early to tell how well it will adjust the damage. The bleeding will continue over the coming months at least you will need to come to the hospital a few times to drain at least and you will need I'm sorry to come to the hospital a few times to drain the cavity to prevent the blood from building up pressure since excessive stress could be fatal I have written you a prescription for prezosin to help you with your nightmares please read the instructions and medicate accordingly try to get a lot of rest and we'll and I will see you next week <coughs> <laughs> forgot to hit send does it matter? I already told him about it. Uh, since you probably forgot, here's me reminding you that I've got that doctor's appointment tomorrow. Uh, example, I'm not coming into work. This means you need to make sure you're actually on time to open up the store, and please unpack the boxes behind the counter. They're starting to become a workplace hazard. Also, books tend to sell much better if they're put on shelves, where people are actually able to see them. It, I said this... I, said the exact same thing but for some reason in a different way 
Whatever. My brain is weird. <laughs> Good luck, you'll need it. Better late than never. Always. Whoopsie. I forgot it's uh right click to go back. Where did I put the tracer fluid? I don't know. I don't know. Is it not there? What's this? Okay. Okay, we'll soon love mom. Come on, radioactive tracer fluid, where are you? I... I thought it was here. Oh, wait. Uh, this must be the accident. Yesterday, a driver distracted by her children ran a red light, causing her to blindside a car in the intersection of the Bloor Street and Spadina Road. The mother and <coughs> excuse me, the mother and her children, traveling in a robust SUV, were left bruised but largely unharmed. Largely unharmed. Okay. The other party was less lucky as the car crashed into the passenger side. Ashley Hall, 23 sustained devastating damages and suffocated from blood trapped in her lungs before the ambulance arrived. Her friends, her friend and driver, Simon Jarrett, 26, survived but with complicated results believed to leave him with permanent brain damage. <coughs> I knew it. The more I talk, the worse my throat gets. It's from this stupid cold that I got. That always happens with me when I get sick. I just, for days and days, I end up coughing hey, Simon, after. Hey, Simon, it's Jesse. You working this weekend or what? I knew there was something you were doing. Was it this weekend or next? Anywho, just shoot me a mail or something. Love you, miss you, mean it. End of messages. I swear, that guy has the memory of a goldfish. Well, I got the email off. He must have caught up by now. Is it here? Why do I always have trouble finding this thing? What? Uh... It's not over here. I was sure. Was certain. Is it in the bathroom? Maybe. I thought it wasn't last time. There it is. Is that where it was last time? I thought last time it was in here. Oh god. Oh my nose! Stop being itchy. <laughs> Yellow. Feels like milk, but the taste—it's like sucking on a penny. There we go. I can't remember what this part is about. Jesse. Hey, Simon. I got your email. Just wanted to wish you good luck and let you know I got you covered. Thanks. I should be able to come to the store after the scan. Don't sweat it. I got Maddie Chris help me out. Maddie from SNL? Uh, guess you didn't hear. He's coming in full time. Work in the comic section. That's Ashley's job. Yeah. Well, you know. Forget it. Not doing her any favors by leaving an empty spot. Not like she's coming back. Well, good luck. Hope they find a way to reverse the whole... You know, dying thing. <laughs> dying thing? You're the worst support ever. <laughs> what should I say? I'll see you later, Jesse. Don't burn the place down while I'm gone. Over and out, buddy. Yeah, find me dying the thing. Home. Like, that doesn't make any sense. <coughs> I might be dying, though. <coughs> I hate 
hate being sick. Also, for some reason, I cough. It hurts in my shoulders. Hello? There we go. It sounded like a fart at first. Let's turn the lights. Hello? Dr. Munchie? Where is everyone? I thought this place would be busy. What's up with this? Huh. Excuse me. Uh, Paul, where are you? We've got a few hours. I got hold of Simon Jarrett. Let's do this. I saw your laptop in reception. Are you already here? Talked to Pace about using the lab this week. I have managed to book the scanner for tomorrow morning and again on Friday. It's not a lot, but they said we could use the empty reception area as a kind of office. It would allow us to use their computers to run models, and also if a time slot opens up, we can get in there and use the scanner rig right away. I thought, excuse me, oh, uh, it's like I talk and then it catches and I can't talk. I thought we could run some tests tomorrow. We could do a scan of each other to learn the equipment. It's supposed to be pretty easy. On Friday, I'm hoping Dr. Aaron Peake will we'll send somebody over. She has a patient that was recently in a car crash. Should be interesting. I found some extra time in the lab today. Unfortunately, nobody told us about the code change, so I called security, talked to Professor Wei to have him vouch for our project, and finally got a hold of some honcho over at Pace's legal department that could re-grant us permission to use the lab. I'm not allowed to repeat the code in mails or texts, but I'll leave a note or something in case we forget. I think it was in here. No. Press and hold R, or that, to move, and move the mouse to rotate objects, okay. Um, is it in here? Uh, I think it was that. No, I don't want that. <coughs> 2501, is that it? Two, five, zero, one. Press and hold shift while moving around. Hello? What's in here? Damn it. <coughs> what about here? Oh. Huh. Hello. Oh, hi. Didn't hear you come in. Simon Jarrett, right? Dr. Munchie? Well, it's uh, just Mr. Munchie. But I'm working on it. <laughs> Actually, you're helping me right now. You look weird for Is some this reason. part of your thesis work? Yeah. It's a study I'm doing with my colleague, Paul Berg. We hope to design a gentle way to work with brain reconstruction to help people like you. Oh, did you uh, take the tracer fluid? Yes. Yes, I did. Great. Well, we can start whenever you're ready. You can still talk to So, him. what exactly are we doing? We're going to do a scan of your brain. Then we build a computer model of it and bombard it with stimuli. The program will help us to quickly iterate your treatment plan until it's fully optimized. In short, develop the perfect treatment for your condition. So it's not just a study, this will actually help me. Well, I should hope so. Otherwise, this would be a huge waste of time. <laughs> and we can still talk You know, to I have him. a serious condition, right? You heard about the car crash, the X months to live deal? Yes, I heard. Must be hard having to hear that. As you know, it's because your brain is weakened so much that it can start to bleed every so often. And if it ever gets real bad, it will kill me. Well, we probably can't restore your brain completely, but we should be able to make those X months turn into years, decades even. And if you take care of yourself and don't do anything too crazy, we should be able to get you to outlive the best of us. Interesting. I just want to see if he says anything else. I really hope you're right about this. Me too. This could make a huge difference for how we treat people with brain damage. So, what do you say? Should we get going? Sure. Let's get started. Take a seat. Oh, okay. Yeah, now we can't talk with him anymore. No, 
noises. All right, let me just get this out of the way. You are Simon Jarrett, correct? Right. Toronto, Canada, the Munchie. Born in 1988, July 16th. Right. Flat neurograph, version six. Good. All files in order. Will this hurt? It's just a scan. It'll hurt about as much as getting your picture taken. Indians thought cameras would steal their souls. That's so. Well, let's hope they're wrong. <laughs> Ready? Say cheese. It's as if we've put on like a Iron Man mask. And then things went wrong. That was interesting. What happened? It flashed my options screen for a second. <coughs> Hello? Mr. Munchie? I don't think he's here anymore. Did something go wrong? Oh, something went wrong, all right. Uh, can we get up? Yes, we can. This isn't funny. Yeah, I, I know it's not funny, but we're actually somewhere we shouldn't be. I, I'm not supposed to put myself in... In what? Oh, jeez. What is this place? I don't remember I get... all these lights. Oh, right, we have to break the glass, I think. I don't like the sounds it makes at the beginning. It makes me think there's always something there. And these things are really weird. Alright, so. Omni Tool Chip Installer. <coughs> Build Shape and Optimizer Up Tool. Okay. I think we need that for a door later on. kind of lag there because of the loading screen. I keep thinking I'm hearing things. Why is this a thing? It's gross and nasty. It's a place to hide. Kelly Air Humidifier. Break room. I don't think there's a whole lot in here. These things freak me out, and I don't know why my screen does this. I've never been able to figure that out. Also, those things are kind of scary. Like, I'm always worried that these things are just going to come alive. Is it only when I'm over here does it? Oh god. I think it's... Uh, I'm scared that something... Ah! Okay. That certainly didn't happen the first time. Will it do it again if I move forward? Scary stuff. wondering if we're like still in this scanner thing and we've like passed out or something. Can we go in here? No. 
and basically we're like in some sort of bad dream because we keep having them, right? Was this open before? What do I need to do to get through? I can't remember. That's where we started. That one's locked. Can't go there. Jesus, that noise scared me, but it's just I stepped on something. Something I have to press? Don't do that. Not here. There's something I'm missing. Fuck off. I'm sorry, I cough right to the mic. Pretty sure you have to go through here. Oh, is it this, maybe? Paul, oh, it's working better than expected. They're having a really hard time getting the doors open. Call Permaseal as many as you can, rather than take any chances. Roger. Did you cut off the factory floor? All done. Should keep most of them out. I'm on my way to lock off the comps out. Just make sure to leave a way out of here. Trust me, I'll get you the data safe and sound. We just need to make sure we're leaving our power running so we don't have to return. I hear that. See you back at camp. How did I do that? anything though. Alright guys, well I wanted to apologize because I don't know how I missed this because it, it seems like it was right in front of me but apparently we gotta touch this guy. Hey you, can you talk? Can you talk like the others? This is open now, but it was forced open. It looks like something's bleeding. Bleeding oil, though. Um. Did it go through there? Uh oh. Thank you guys for watching and be sure to leave a like if you've enjoyed as it does help me out a lot. If you like the music you're currently listening to, click the music icon. And if you want, check out my other various social medias by clicking the logos or by checking the description box down below. Also, don't forget to check out my fellow YouTube friends in the list on my channel to the right side. 
And of course, don't forget to subscribe and be a part of the Clouder today. It's like chowder, but with cats. <laughs>